Hi, this is David Shumi at Framing Equipment Reviews. I've just got with me a little studio V-nail joiner. Now, I'm a professional picture framer. I've always used big cassis machines, but I just thought I'd get one of these, order it in, have a little look inside the box and see what it does. So we'll open it up and have a look. Okay, so I think the way this works is those bars go straight into there. We'll just pop it in and have a quick look. So there's actually some uh, some little Allen bolts to hold those vertical bars in place. I'm just going to set it up and we'll see if it joins, how successfully it joins. feels quite solidly made, but again, it's only a small machine. It's probably going to suit someone who's uh, making frames at home and doing things that are probably up to about 65, 70 millimetres wide. So yeah, two bars. Gosh, I think I probably should have looked at those. Wing nuts on the end. So this is designed to actually pin your um, V-nail into a frame. And it's going to pin it upside down. So unlike uh, professional tool works on the principle of um, of actually having actually I'll put that on the wrong way around there we go so it's going to work on the principle of driving the v-nail into the timber You'd still have to glue that, but that will go into this clamp. I just want to see how well the clamp actually holds that frame together. This will join one corner at a time. Uh, some of the string clamps and things like that will join the, the whole frame up. That actually seems to sit quite tight in there. You'd normally apply some PVA glue to this. But so we can clamp that and then at least you can see you can get into the back of it there and that's where you're going to put the v-nail. Something you can do is mark the position where you would normally put that v-nail into place. I'm just going to stick, this has a magnetic catch so I can stick the v-nail in position there and I can come down now I want to get that lined up just where I want it to go. Takes a little bit of getting used to where you're going to put the thing. We'll see what kind of driving depth it's got. Wow, now I put a 15 mm V-nail in there. Nearly put it all the way in. I probably should have had that bar just a touch lower. We'll just stick another one in. In fact, I'll come back and just drive that home. That was quite successful. You can stick the other V-nail on. Actually, that's quite a strong magnet. So I'm going to put two V-nails in position. You have to sort of line it up by eye there. There isn't a physical adjustment. And then that's a very smooth lever action. So what I've done, I've managed to put in two V-nails. Let's just have a look and see. All in all, that has produced quite a good join. If you want to find out more about picture framing equipment, visit framingequipmentreviews.com.